Okay, so let's get started here. I'm using the Hello Kitty cartridge, and there are so many cute things on the Hello Kitty cartridge that I forgot about. First of all, right in front here, the Hello Kitty with a little umbrella, perfect for the fall. Then there's a little snowman and the tree, the Hello Kitty with the little reindeer antlers, and then uh, the Hello Kitty with the hat, Merry Christmas, the bat. Then there's this um, pumpkin and her in a costume, another costume, and then Happy Halloween. So anyway, I'm having so much fun with this. So let's get started. It's on page 70, and the perfect size that I need is 3 inches. So I'm going to press this, and just press cut, and we'll start cutting this little Hello Kitty out here. So let's go ahead, press cut, and get started here. Alright, for our next thing we're going to do is this Happy Halloween, so I'm going to press the Happy Halloween sign, and I'm going to want to cut this at, oh, and also the close, close, I didn't press that, so let me press close, close, that's the bottom one here, if you wanted the top one, you'd push the shift button, but for this, I am going to press close, close, and then I've been messing around with the font size, and here's one, size one inch, and that's what I like, so I'm going to cut it at one inch, there we go. Press cut and when we come back we're going to need to cut the face out. Okay, so I've got the white paper loaded up here and now we need to cut the Hello Kitty face. So what we're going to do is for the face we have to do white and fur, bow and nose on page 70. And so we're going to go ahead and press that. So that's bow and nose, white and fur. And press Hello Kitty 18. It's set for one inch which isn't what we need. We're going to need to adjust that to three because that's what we originally cut out Hello Kitty in. So let's move her up to a three. There we go. Press cut. And when we come back, we have more items to cut out, like the little bow and her little item that she has, her little sucker. Okay, so the next thing we need to do here is get the green backing because all these letters are going to be popped out and there needs to be a color that shows through. So what I'd like to do is use this green shimmer paper. I have my depth set at 6, my uh, blade is set at 6, and then the pressure needs to be set at max because this is very thick paper. So in order to get the blackout for that, or excuse me, the shadow, we need to press the shadow. So let me find the shadow button here. Shadow and Happy Halloween. It's already set at 1 inch, so that's perfect. I'm going to go ahead and press cut, and when we come back, we're going to cut uh, the other items that we need to cut out. Okay, the next item that we need to cut is this little sucker wrapper here. So we need to press close, close. So we'll press that. And then we need to hit the shift button because it's on the upper corner here. And then we're going to press the Hello Kitty 18 and it shows it's the shift and it should show the little wrapper here. So let's go ahead and press cut. It's going to cut this out. Oops, I cut it at one inch. That's a little too small. We need it at three inch, which will match what we cut the Hello Kitty out. At. So let's go ahead and repeat, repeat last and hit cut. Perfect. And now we're going to go ahead and go arrow down onto this one here. This orange piece of paper is what I'm going to use to do the little uh, bow here and then also her little paw. I thought it would be really cute. So still continue on page 70. What we need to do is hit the shift button and the white and fur. And we're doing shift because it's up in this corner. The white and fur. So we'll press that one there, and then we also need to press the Hello Kitty 18 so that it knows which one we're doing. It's set at 3 inches, which is good because that's what we cut the Hello Kitty at. So we'll go ahead and cut that, and the next one we're going to do is the close, close little paw for her. So this is the close, close, and that's her little paw, which you guys see right here. So let's go ahead and hit close, close. And Hello Kitty 18, once again, set at 3. We'll press cut, and when we come back, we'll put this all together. Okay, so what I've done here is just, just a regular 5x7 pre-made card. And I've gone and taken this Halloween paper. You saw me have the card stack with this. And then this is a ribbon that I got from Michaels for a dollar and just doubled up on the uh, black paper on the back here. So I'm going to go ahead and put some adhesive on here, if I can, so it will come out. Hmm. There we go. That's working better. Okay. 
So put that on here. And then I'm going to add just a little bow. I thought would be kind of cute. So I'm just going to do it this way. I like it, doing the bows like this just because then it, it helps the bow come out perfect every time. There we go. And I will trim this off here. There we go. And this one right across here. You guys are going to think this Hello Kitty is so cute. So let me come right back and I'll show you what we're doing with the Hello Kitty. Okay, so this is how cute the little Hello Kitty turned out here with the little sucker and the bow and the little, um, her little fingers on there. I think it looks so cute in her little costume. And I went ahead and put mounting foam on the back here. So I'll just put her along here. And then I have mounting foam for this one too, the little Happy Halloween. Didn't that turn out adorable too? And that's with the glitter in the background that we cut out. So I'll go ahead and put that down here. Oops, put that up there and press that. So there's our completed card with the little Hello Kitty for Happy Halloween. So enjoy you guys, have a terrific day, bye bye.